If you're shopping for one of the best HP laptops you may find yourself bewildered by all the options on offer. HP has multiple ranges of laptops, in all manner of sizes and in a dazzling array of configurations, in this video, we narrow things down so that you can easily pick out the model that'll work best for you. But before we dive into that, make sure you click that subscribe button to stand a chance of winning an iPhone 13 Pro in our upcoming 5000 subscribers draw. And for more information and updated pricing on the products mentioned, be sure to check the links in the description below. Okay, let's dive in. In no particular order, our first pick is HP Envy 13, the best HP laptop for working from home. Are you looking for an excellent all-arounder for working from home? The HP Envy 13 should suffice, it's compact and capable, and while it's unlikely to inspire genuine envy, it has more than enough power for both creative work and day-to-day -day professional tasks. With options going up to an Intel Core i7, it's not exactly a powerhouse, but it's more than capable of handling most design applications. It features a durable aluminum chassis, a comfortable keyboard, and a bright 13.3-inch display. This is a capable machine that does not require any compromises. The main drawback is the touchpad, which is made of plastic. The pros are, stylish and compact, good battery life great display and performance. And the cons are, plastic touchpad. Next on the list is HP ZBook Studio G8, the best HP laptop for photo editing. While you don't always require a stack of power while editing images, there are times when you'll find yourself working with a large image and a stack of filters and in need of all the grunt you can get. Therefore, if you're looking for the finest HP laptop for image editing, we recommend the ZBook Studio G8. Even in its most basic configuration, it has more than enough horsepower for everyday photo editing, and in more expensive configurations, it is capable of handling the most demanding creative software. It's compact and lightweight, with a clear and brilliant 15.6-inch display and Bang & Olufsen tuned speakers for superior sound quality. The pros are, solid design, good battery life, impressive speakers, and the cons are, can get a bit warm. Next on the list is HP ZBook Fury 17 G8, the best HP laptop for video editing. The average laptop is insufficient if your work involves a significant amount of video, therefore, if you require a computer that will not die when confronted with a stack of 4K footage, the HP ZBook Fury 17 G8 is the way to go. Although it is not the most visually appealing laptop, this small workstation packs a punch in terms of performance, especially when you upgrade to more powerful hardware. Naturally, this level of performance comes at a cost, and you'll also notice that this is not one of the most portable laptops. It's large and heavy, and you shouldn't rely on it if you're not near an electrical outlet, as the battery life isn't very long. The pros are, top-notch performance, gorgeous touchscreen, and the cons are, really heavy, poor battery life. Up next is HP EliteBook 840G7, the best HP laptop for business. If you're looking for a business laptop but don't need a ton of graphical horsepower for creative applications, the HP EliteBook 840G7 should fit your moderate requirements and then some. There are no sophisticated GPUs here, just integrated Intel graphics, but what it does have is an extremely outstanding battery life that allows you to work all day and even late at night without needing to plug it in. Additionally, there is an excellent keyboard and a plethora of ports, and if you don't want corporate spies peering at your monthly financials, there is a SureView privacy display that ensures only you can see what's on screen. The pros are, comfortable keyboard, excellent battery life good value, and the cons are, weak graphical performance. And the last but not the least is the HP Omen 17, the best HP laptop for gaming. The HP Omen 17 is an absolute beast of a gaming laptop, which means that it will not only run all the latest games in full detail with as many frames per second as you require, but it will also be capable of devouring the most demanding design applications. The entry-level configuration isn't cheap, but with the mobile version of the GeForce RTX 3070 at its core, it's a capable graphics performer. 
however, for serious performance, you can spend quite a bit more on a model with an additional 16GB of RAM and the top-of-the-line RTX 3080, which should easily outperform the ordinary desktop PC. The pros are, fantastic performance, great display, while the cons are, quite hefty, poor battery life. And that's all for now, if you enjoyed this video, please go ahead and leave a like, if you're new to the channel and you like the video consider subscribing. Be sure to check out the description for links to find the most up-to-date pricing and deals on all the products mentioned in this video. And now, you've been tech quadrangled. You're now better informed to buy it right the first time. See you in the next video, cheers, have a good one.